Hey guys, it's Brad. So I'm back from a long winter's nap, and here we are in February. And uh, this is the weekend. What's today? I guess it's the 16th, and uh, February 16th. And uh, I know you're wondering, what am I doing out here messing with Bermuda in February? Well, the time is now for a, let's call it a pre-treatment, because what we're doing is a weed treatment before everything comes out it's putting down pre-emergent and i talked about this last year so in october uh i was telling you guys put down some lesco 007 in october and you know i did that and so what happens is um this pre-emergent it catches a lot of weeds and it prevents a lot of weeds but there's some that still get through and so this is going to happen with all of them. I don't care what you use. If you use Weed Stop or uh, some other kind of product, you know, a liquid product, anything, doesn't matter. All of these products, they have a lot of weeds that they get rid of, but there's always these handful of weeds that are just going to come through anyway. So what we want to do right now is put down some Lesco 007. Do not do this. Do not go out there and get the stuff that's like, 1609 or whatever you see at Lowe's uh, you'll see it says Lesco crabgrass control be careful only get Lesco 007 that's the only kind to get because you don't want to put you know the nitrogen on your yard right now it's just not going to be healthy for it so this is a treatment just to help with spring weeds that are going to come up and uh, you can go to Lowe's Home Depot and get this stuff by the way um, or site one they have it I'm using the uh, Lesco Stonewall and um, you know I can't tell a huge difference between that and just the Lesco that you would get at Home Depot I've used both uh, so get either one it doesn't matter I think the one at Home Depot is cheaper but um, yeah we're gonna get this stuff on the yard and I'm gonna show you afterwards some pictures of the weeds that got through this winter so just uh, hang tight All right, guys, so I got all that pre-emergent put out. And remember, what we're doing, we're trying to prevent. We're trying to get ahead of it. So when these springtime weeds start coming up, you'll have something to get rid of them. And also the existing weeds, something to go on that to take care of those. And uh, I'm going to take you around here to the side and just show you what I got going on. All right, so over here on the side, you can see I've got some weeds going on. But I want to show you this. Last year, this whole area... I don't know if you remember the very first video I did last year. This stuff was above my ankles with Poa annua. And it was awful. It took me a long time to get rid of because I did not do this treatment last year. So uh, I'll show you some other stuff. Got some weeds going on right here that have come up. And this will help with that. Now we're this is not the only weed treatment this year, but this is just to give us a head start. And right here, Poa annua, right there. Now the thing about Poa annua is that as it warms up and we get really, really hot, 
over the next you know three four months it'll die out because it really is a winter weed and um, I had that problem last year couldn't get rid of it but when we really got into the 90s it just went away so if you do this treatment and it doesn't go away it will in the hotter months so just trust me on that I got something else to show you too some more weeds I got going right there I got a bear spot that's come up right here and I'll talk more about that uh, as we get on into the growing season some more poa annua now the backyard's done really good um, I have a few spots that are a little bit of trouble and they usually are every year on the back but um, I'm gonna show you this real quick this stuff right here that stuff is everywhere I've got it all over the place but it's just on this one little strip and I'll show you back here where my tree is just on this one little strip and you can see how it kind of extends out and some of that is poa annual over there but when you look up here this right here it is almost completely weed free and that is I'm gonna give that to uh, Lesco the pre-emergent for uh, helping that to happen and this side of the house over here it's probably the worst and you can see right there what I'm walking up on that's a mess that's poa annua and I've got some more over there see some bare spots that have come up that I need to do something about again I'll talk more about those uh, later in the year and uh, check this out got that right there I need to get rid of that purple black looking stuff clover I need to get rid of that and uh, I don't think let's go I don't think let's is gonna get rid of that and uh, the thing is is that <laughs> you know it does really good it attacks a lot of weeds but the thing is is uh, I'm gonna show you some stuff some expensive stuff later on this year to help get rid of these other weeds and um, I just got a ton of stuff going on out here but it's nowhere near as bad as last year because I did the fall treatment of the pre-emergent and now I'm doing this February treatment so guys I'm gonna be back at it in about a month I'm gonna come out here and talk about scalping getting your yard ready so the other thing is uh, yeah don't don't get over worried about these weeds because um, you do this treatment they'll be gone um, and scalping will help that I know it's weird a lot of people won't tell you that but it does and uh, I have noticed that but guys I'll have another video in about a month to talk about that do not fertilize yet please 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 do not fertilize yet and don't freak out over these weeds and uh, other than that I guess uh, I'm back at it guys so uh, please like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in about a month.